Cooking with the vegan zombie. Oh, hey, what's up? Welcome to another episode of Cooking with the Vegan Zombie. It's snack time with the vegan zombie. What are we gonna make today? Guacamole. And here's what you're gonna need. Avocado, garlic, a little bit of red onion, jalapeno, some lime juice, and you're gonna finish it with, of course, salt and pepper. Let's start with our avocado. What I like to do is just cut it in half, split it, Ugh. and then just take the seed out, boom, like that. And you just scoop it out with a spoon and plop it right in there. With the garlic, um, generally what I like to do is use a clove of garlic per avocado. So we're going to use two today. Um, if you don't like garlic as much as I do, just use one. It'll be fine. Perfect. Add that. This is really easy, really quick to make. So if you're on the run, this is the snack for you. Now, we'll start with the juice of half of a lime. Squeeze it all in there. You just gotta get it in there. Now it's time to mash your garlic, and your avocado together, like so. Now if you don't have this pastry cutter tool, just use a fork, it all works the same. You just wanna get mush out of it, you know? You just gotta mush it. Smells good. All right, so we got a nice little small dice going on with these onions. You're only going to want to add a couple, you know, maybe a quarter of a cup, no more than that. So toss that in. So I want to use, I'm probably, I'm, I'm a wimp. I don't like spicy stuff. So I'm going to use half of a jalapeno. You can, you can add the whole thing if you're feeling awesome. But I'm going to just play it safe, like I always do. Because nobody wants to be running from zombies with an upset stomach. I know I don't. We'll take our small pieces of jalapeno. Dice it up really fine. Now we're ready to toss it in. Here we go. Ah. This is how much salt you have to add. Half a teaspoon. A little, little pepper. I never keep track of how much pepper I put in. But that felt good to me. And then, stir it all together. A lot of people put cilantro in it, and a lot of people I know don't like cilantro. A lot of people I used to know didn't like cilantro, so I stopped putting it in. Um, and it's, it's really good without it, but if you really want cilantro in there, throw it in. Well, that's all there is to it. Takes like 10 minutes to make and uh, really easy. Let's give her a little taste. Holy guacamole! Oh, you know what though? I don't have anything to eat this with. I gotta get out of here and go grab me some chips, but until I come back, check us out at thevegansommy.com and I'll see you in another episode.